Okay, video time. Um, what you want to check out for uh, the rhythm uh, 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 of, of this tune. Uh, what was the name of it? One Sweet World. One Sweet World. Um, Dave Matthews' tune is the same as you're going to want to do for all rhythms of all songs you will ever learn ever. Wow. Pretty sweeping language, Matt. Yes. Um, so the trick is, is we're keeping our foot, which you can't see in this, maybe one, two, so we're keeping our foot moving at a regular pulse, okay? And as we're doing that, our hand is in the exact same rhythm as it. So when our foot goes down, our hand goes down, okay? And when our foot comes up, mm -hmm. our hand comes up, okay? So it's one, and, two, and, three, and, four, and, okay? So that's the right half of what you're, of what you're, got it, focus on. In the left hand here, on the neck, we're playing the E flat, we're playing the B flat over D, and we're playing A flat. Now, these three chords you've been playing now for a couple weeks, and so you know them, and that's good. But you want to make sure that you have them really well memorized, because you don't want to be splitting your concentration while you're doing this. Right. The, so, for the sake of, of the first exercise what I'm about to do here, we're just going to stay on one chord. We're just going to stay on the E flat, and we're going to play that rhythm where we play one, the and of two with an upstroke, and then the and of four with an upstroke. Okay, so all on that E flat. So it's gonna go one and two, and three, and four, and one, two, three, four. One and two, and three, and four, and one, two, three, four, okay? So you see, now we're just stayed on one chord. It's a much easier rhythm to play now in this in this in this case because we're not having to think about moving the chords, right? Right. So as you get more and more comfortable with that, your hand will start will start just kind of getting some muscle. Your right hand, that is, will start getting some muscle memory developed as to that rhythm. And two, and three, and four, and one, two, three, four, one, and two, and three, and four, and one, two, three, four. So as that becomes more comfortable, then start adding in the other chords, where it's one and two. Notice that my right hand is doing nothing different from when it was to playing just the one chord, right? It's just playing up, up, right? It's doing down, up, up. One and two and three and four and one, two, three. The hand is this. This hand, my right hand, is completely regimented, doing the same thing, which leaves me free to concentrate on changing the chords and getting them in the right place. So. Metronome. This is what you need to work with on this. I, okay. And I have one. Marvelous. I do. <laughs> so start with it right now. Let's start with it at around 70 beats per minute. Okay. We're just playing the E flat. Um, uh, 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 this is this is future you I'm talking to. The guy on the other side of the screen. <laughs> uh, so we're, I'm just going to play along, E flat, play along with me here, we're just going to play E flat, and we're going to play it in that rhythm, one, the and of two, and then the and of four, two, three, and four, and one, and two, and three, and four, and one, two, three, four, one, and two, and three, and four, and one, two, three, four, one, and Time three, four, one and two and three and four and one, two, three, four. Cool. Let's turn this puppy up. So that was 70. Let's take it now at 90, okay? Because this tune is pretty moving. Like it's not a it's not a slow tune. So we're gonna have to uh, gonna have to make sure that our tempos are we're comfortable at pretty much any tempo doing the same thing. Just the E flat. Actually, I take that back. Let's just do the B flat over D. So we can even practice our different chords while doing this. Oh, it's so meta. All right, ready? Oh, one, two, three, and four, and one, and two, and three, and four, and one. Now we'll turn it up again. 
And guess what chord we're gonna play? Yeah, that's right. You guessed it. A flat. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna play the A flat, same rhythm. Now we're going at 110, I believe is where I set that to. One, two, here we go. One and two and three and four and one, two, three, four. One and two and three and four and one, two, three, four. One and two and three and four and one. Last time, three, four. One and two and three and four and one, two, three, four. Yeah. All right. So there you have that same rhythm on one chord being played um, all the way up to 110. Okay, I'm sure that that's pretty much quick enough to get you into the song. Um, so what you then want to do is start as you get your hand, your right hand, more comfortable, just keeping loose, even time. Um, <laughs> that sounds almost like a, like a, like a, like it's a, a loose, even, like self, self uh, defeating. But no, your right hand is loose while keeping even time. Ooh, that's what I mean. Then you start changing the chords. One and two and three. That's 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 why when you add the chords, you add the chord changes after your right hand is already comfortable um, playing this, this these rhythm figures. Okay.